uh, very much for having me here this afternoon to allow me to come. Uh, it's a great pleasure to be here. Uh, as was mentioned, I was a member of parliament elected with Jack Layton in 2011 uh, for the New Democratic Party. Uh, it was a very great honour to serve in parliament for seven years uh, to address the problems of the nation and to try to work to bring everybody together. Uh, I am now, I've resigned my seat now, I'm running to be the next mayor of Vancouver. But I think I'd like to tell you one story that reflects my values. Uh, I, uh, I was meeting with an ambassador for another country, and he was unfamiliar with Canada, and he said to me, uh, isn't it great how Canadians tolerate all these different uh, all these different groups, all these different religions in Canada? I said, no, no, Mr. Ambassador, we don't tolerate. And then he said, well, isn't it great how you accept different cultures and religions? I said, no, Mr. Ambassador, it's not that we accept. I said, Mr. Ambassador, what we do is celebrate. What we do is respect, what we celebrate to, to bring what is Canada together into a group where we all accept each other and help each other forward. So I hope that reflects uh, how I feel about uh, being a leader, both in Parliament and hopefully now in the city of Vancouver. Uh, moving to city politics, one of the main concerns for everyone in the region is housing. There's not enough affordable housing in Vancouver, and that is front and center of my platform. Uh, before I was elected in 2011, I was a professor at Simon Fraser University. I have a PhD from the London School of Economics, and I specialize in cities and housing. So I put together a plan to bring more affordable housing to, uh, to uh, Vancouver, and that would uh, be built on nonprofit housing that uh, would be run by different societies, and so I'd be very grateful if if I could talk to your community as well, if I'm elected, to talk about perhaps bringing a culturally sensitive housing, uh, which we seem to forget. It's not just it's not just uh, houses people live in; it's homes, and homes are culturally specific. So we need to make sure that we're building homes that are that are appropriate uh, for everyone to live in. And, and I would love to talk to you uh, after the election about how we might move uh, housing for your community forward. So uh, this election is is. Uh, you know, it's it's a it's a wide open. We've had Gregor Robertson, who is just to retire as mayor after 10 years. Uh, so it's a change election where uh, we'll be presenting uh, different views. Uh, my view is of celebration. I'm very very much upset about the new government in Quebec and how they said that they will use Section 33 of the Charter to override religious charter rights. I will do everything in my power to speak out for that. I know my NDP colleagues in Ottawa are doing that as well. But we don't need that here in British Columbia. Uh, we need to not just accept, but to celebrate, to embrace the best of each other and to move forward. So uh, I, I don't want to take too much of your time. I'm happy to answer your questions afterward. But I, I would like to very much thank you for having me here today. Uh, my respect back to you. Thank you very much for being here. Uh, the election is October 20th, and I do hope that uh, you will vote for me, but most importantly that you vote in the election because uh, we all need to do that to make our democracy better.